Hello, hello. How's it going, everybody? I am on here live today on Instagram, and I have Carrie coming on here with me today, who is an incredible adventure coach. And um, we have an exciting tour coming up that we want to share more about. We are T minus four months away, and I am very, very, very excited for it. So here comes Carrie. You guys are here with us say hello in the comments and let us know where you're coming from as well i know it's kind of a global community on here there we are hello, my sister. <laughs> awesome awesome so we have carrie here who's an incredible adventure coach oh my goodness if you're not following her yet please go ahead after you watch this live and go follow her because you will just be amazed at the inspo. And so she is living over in Austria. She's actually Canadian, but she's living over in Austria. And she is um, hosting Soul Series Adventures. And part of that is the Tyrolean Mountain High, which I have the pleasure of co-guiding with her this year, which I am just like so fired up about because it is going to be such a transformational experience. So if you're somebody who is wanting to go on an adventure, it is going to be way more than just like an external hiking mountains adventure, then this is definitely going to be something that you are going to want to tune into. So Carrie, tell us well, more. Well, <laughs> yeah, we, Laura and I were just talking separately and we were talking about the tour and we were so excited about it that we said, let's just get on and share it. <laughs> so that's why we're here. And this week actually marks the, the 10 year anniversary of me of when I moved to Europe, moved to Austria. Uh -huh. And it was a, a, a dream to move here for many years. And it was exactly 10 years ago that I did. And this tour culminates right around that dream because it's where I did all the hikes. So basically on this tour, it's all the hikes that I started with here that I kept going on, that I continue to go on. So it's all my favorite day hikes and multi-day hikes combined into this magic blend of Austrian culture and spontaneity and uh, magic of the mountains. So you're really in, you're really in an authentic space. Uh, when you go to the city, closest city is Innsbruck. It's like a uh, city right in the mountains. They're not, there's not too many of those where you, where you have a city in the mountains. And so you can find your way and do stuff around there. It's, I take you to the kind of off the beaten path where there's no gondola and we hike it, we hike it. And we stay in a mountain hut just above my home here. And it's really, what's the word? It's kind of raw, raw land because there's not, there's no real tourists up there. There's mountain lakes that you can, you can skinny dip, you can meditate by. There's so, peaks, like 3,000 meter peak, peaks we're gonna climb to, or one peak. There's so much in that realm, but just what Laura shared with you, there's uh, so much more. So the space here is kind of hard to put words to, but whenever I've done those Tyrolean mountain high tours, it's just something unfolds really magical. And the people that come to the tour are meant to be there and they all kind of just blend with their own personalities and own reasons for being there. And it just, this story unfolds. And so that's what we're, that we can't wait for this summer in Austria. Um, August 22nd to the 28th is the tour. Get in on it, it is four months away. And definitely with any tips like training and getting ready for this we got you covered any details to do with this tour we got you covered but this is uh this is a special one this is a unique one mm -hmm. like laura said it's not just an adventure tour this is like an adventure within you're going in baby as you're climbing out yeah so yeah. right and I feel like that's really the magic of it, right? Because there's so much stuff going on in everyone's life right now. Like, oh my goodness, there's so much. And getting into spaces like this, like it's a transformational space when you are in the middle of a mountain, <laughs> 3,000 meters up, like yeah. just connected yeah. 
character. And I was sharing this with Carrie as well, where even when I went away to Finland, it was like getting disconnected from my current life that I'm living right here, getting reconnected to nature, which then in turn, when I came back home, I got reconnected yeah. to myself doing it. I'm living with like so much more vibrance again from that place. So that's really what this tour is about. It's about disconnecting from what's happening in your life. So you can go reconnect to nature and move all of that stuff and just get oh, moved oh. in such a transformational way so that you can then come back to your life and reconnect to be more connected to yourself, be more connected to your life, more connected to everything that's going on so that you can really like do what you want to do in life with more vibrance and more um, energy. We hear it a lot. Thank you for that, Laura. You'd said everything that I wanted to say, but mountains move you. They don't look like they're moving, they are moving, but, but they, it moves you. It's like one of those things you look at an ocean and it, it's all, always kind of moving, but this mountains kind of just stay there and they've got this, this power and this, yeah, you can, it's like hugging a tree. You can ask for, for guidance and you're going to get something back, whatever that is. And when you can do it in a space, where other like-minded people who want a challenge, so you're gonna be challenged. So this is for people that love adventures, that love mountains, that love to be challenged. So you're gonna be climbing the meters, right? And through that, you have the support of, of the group climbing with you and whatever comes through, I've seen many different things come through as, as we climb. Uh, you get to uh, discover, you get to whatever it is, whether you want to write a book or you want to move through a transition or just come and experience. Maybe you don't know what it is, but you're, you're pulled, you're pulled to it. Mm -hmm. I trust these things. If someone's pulled here uh, to the mountains in some way and something kind of, I, I know I, I talked to an old client of mine that came on this tour. He had goosebumps when I first, when he, saw the flyer and we first chatted. He had little goosebumps and he was terrified to go. He had a fear. He hadn't, he hadn't traveled alone for 30 years. So the goosebumps told him he needed to go on the Tyrolean mountain high. Yep. And he was ter that's back in, the, he gave me a check. So remember when we used checks, he was actually shaking because he, he knew he had to go and to get over this thing. So I've been able to travel on his own uh, overseas. So he did that. And on the first day, I'd overcome this massive, this massive obstacle that he hadn't even stepped through for 30 years by just saying yes and, and just coming. And that was the beginning. I love that. And then he met a woman of his dreams and then this and this and this. So, uh, so when you put yourself in the space like this, like with two really cool people like us <laughs> um and then coming to austria such a rich raw amazing space that that I, I live in it's um i i you know what else can i say yeah yeah but uh yeah transformational moments when it was just like it didn't make logical sense but it was just like this intuitive like i i don't i, I need to do this this is what i need to do i don't know what's going to come out on the other side but i need to do it and yeah I love that story, how everything kind of transpired for him after yeah. he did it. And I know you shared another one um, where another lady, she wrote a book and multiple books after doing one yeah. of the event series as well. Yeah, she was going through stuff in that moment. She needed to be on her own. She needed to park in a mountain hut and take the day away from us. And all this stuff was just coming through her. And she, then her books were titled Messages from the Mountains. Wow. Uh, hey, and even as a book, is not a bestseller, it's just for her. She wrote two books, like, hello. And uh, what, whatever it is, whatever it is, for me, it was uh, a lot of um, working through a lot of my own stuff and to realizing that I wanted, I really did want to live here. Mm -hmm. Even though I was married at the time, I had to kind of come back to Austria continually to get clear on things. And so I'd always just come right here and that's why this tour is so special, is because this is the the exact footprints on where it unfolded. So this is kind of the heart and soul of all the adventure tours. All the adventure tours are out of this world, but this one is 
where it all kicked off 13 years ago. Oh, I love that. Well, I'm super fired up. I can't wait to just be there and connect with you and connect with all of the other beautiful humans that decide to join on this tour. Mm. So magical. I know. This is calling to you if you're watching this right now and you're wanting to have more information or you're wanting to join us and just feel free to reach out to either Carrie or myself and uh, we can share more information with you and we would absolutely love to have you join us. Let's rock it. Let's rock 2023 oh. guys. Yes. In the rocks. Yes. In the rocks. <laughs> <laughs> I love you. <laughs> with a rattler and a schnapps. How yes. about that? And a there. couple of noodles. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yes. <laughs> the are my favorites. <laughs> a couple of noodles. <laughs> Goodness. I'm so excited. All right. Okay. Well, thank you so much, Carrie, for coming on here. Thank you to everybody who's on live with us and watching the replay. If you want to join us for the Tyrolean Mountain High, then um, go ahead and put Tyrol in the comments, T I R O L, and we'll reach out to you or just send us a personal message. And we would love to be able to share more information about with this. I love it. I love it. Ciao, ciao. Have a great night, everybody. Bye. Bye, Carrie.